guys, it's Bro You Whack, and welcome to Season 8. Today, I'm gonna be able to show you all of the Season 8 shop skins early, but first, I just want you to appreciate the home screen. I don't know why they zoomed in so much because they're missing the best part. So, first thing we're gonna be looking at is all the weapon charms, and for this season, we're gonna be getting five in the shop. The first one is gonna be a compass. At least oh, oh, the disco ball actually has a little sound effect. Wait, also, the compass has one too. Wait, the hot chocolate has one as well. Ice monkey! Oh, Mark Skull doesn't get one. Who's the chick? Is that... Is that Mercy? That, that that don't look like Mercy if that's Mercy. But the first hero that's getting a Season 8 shop skin is Doomfist. Now, I haven't seen any of these skins, so you're gonna see my live... Ra hey! Yo! Look at my boy getting funky with it! With the 80s orange suit! Oh, popping it! So he can see the little bit of chest that he's got going on! <laughs> he even has little turntable dials on his fist, and he has a mic on his shoulder! Oh, that's so cool. It says Doom. He's got headphones. Yo, I love his fro <laughs> and the sunglasses, too. Yo, they got my boy Big Pimpin'. Doofus is slowly becoming one of my favorite heroes when it comes to skins, but that's probably what the, the disco weapon charm is from. We also have a Highlander show called Get Down. Hold on. No, 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 no. We gotta do this right. We gotta do this right. Oh, he got the splits too. My boy Flexible and Funky. One more time. My god, that's one of the coolest highlighted shows of all time. All right, so we're starting off hot. Who else got a skin? Bago also got a season eight skin. Oh my god, he matches the new Samoa map, the volcano one with his hair. <laughs> his hair actually kind of reminds me of like flaming hot macaroni and cheese. But besides that, the skin is looking fire. Literally, he's on fire. Let's check out the guns real quick. Okay, so that's pretty uh, standard. And then the other one is all right. So they're looking pretty normal. But he also got a battle pass skin and out of the two I, I think i like this one a little bit more i don't know both look pretty good though ryan Hart is getting a skin as well which is a legendary skin called heaven's devil and oh oh my okay so <laughs> I'm, I'm a little bit pissed because his heaven's devil skin is just the recoloration of his rain heart skin and this is supposed to be a starcraft collaborative skin released back in i think 2021 when blizzcon online came out and not a lot of people got this skin because i think it cost like 40 dollars to get the virtual ticket and now we get the blue version of it there's his hammer it's all blue and whatnot there's little check marks to represent fire. i don't know what that's supposed to be we also have a weapon skin wait a weapon skin wait that this is a new thing well, uh, hold on a second Look, hard light is gonna be available in the shop to purchase so i guess wait this looks like echo this this literally is echo there's her top of her head this is where her face supposed to be so now you can buy gun skins that just what i guess it all just depends on how much skins are gonna be for guns it just seems random that we're getting an echo hammer for reinhardt but i, I guess what's cool is that you can equip the hammer with any skin that you want like we can equip it with like cardboard boxes Reinhardt and you can have the echo hammer with cardboard box Reinhardt if you're into that kind of thing oh wait there's sound effects too okay happy holidays, happy holidays to you too tracer and it has a cool special effect as well roadhog is next and with his rework he's gonna get a polar hog skin <laughs> he looks so cute oh look at his little face oh he looks so adorable he, he kind of looks like a corgi a little bit with the snout oh this is such a cute polar bear i'm assuming it's a polar bear skin it kind of fits the theme of the season eight battle pass all right well what does his accessories look like what is his tan oh it's a little bait can a little salt shaker and the gun is just a, a bone skin and then the hook is uh oh that's a hacksaw just kind of cut up a little bit oh that's such a cute little hog skin what does his emote look like oh we got we got to equip this if we're gonna be looking at the new emote so we got a slow roll oh, wait that's what the uh the season eight weapon charm is inspired from so that's what the little bite is from is from his hook him just cooking a mutton chop you're not you have not cooked that enough yeah, you better cook that some more. We also have a spray, which is just his belly button belt uh, as a spray. Sigma's also joining the fun with the plunder. Oh, what? Oh my god, they did it again. Plunder by itself looks good, but it's definitely second to Flying Dutchman, which is just another pirate skin without the glowy effect. Oh, oh, wait, hold on a second. That cool globe, do you have a globe? Oh, you do, but it's not glowy. Then we got sea urchins for Sigma. I don't like when they do that, but if you like Sigma, Sigma and you like toes then you get more pirate fun for him winston 
you better not have a recolored legendary skin. Okay, you got ugly sweater. Oh, thank you, Blizzard. Thank you for blessing us with the Winton ugly sweater skin. See, this is what we want. We want winter skins. I'm not dressed up for nothing. I also just noticed that his knuckle armor lights up, but why is his middle finger red? I know why his middle finger is red. <laughs> oh, that's so cute, man, with his red glasses. What does his Tesla cannon look like? Okay, that's looking good. This is only an epic skin, and it's a Winton skin. I mean, how can you hate a Winton skin? We also have a victory pose, which, hold on, we gotta do this right if we're gonna be looking at him lounging with his big, giant mug. Hey, what you got in there? Is that- I, I can't see. Is that Coco? Zarya finally got a skin! Hopefully, it's a good one. It's an epic skin. <laughs> it's her first shop skin, but it's gonna be- Oh, okay. All right, that, that ain't too bad. Wait a sec, this literally is I just realized I'm supposed to not tell you what the name is. They're gonna be changing the name to something else because of obvious copyright. And I would not be surprised if this skin also got copyrighted by, you know, the big D, if you know what I mean. Vergon is also looking blue and frozen. I mean, it's an epic skin, so they're not gonna do much, but th this is looking great, man. It's obviously inspired by a certain movie that I don't want to say because I don't want to get copyrighted. We also have emo, which is her folk dance emo. Uh, don't know what this has to do with Christmas, but you, you, hey, get a girl, get a girl. Is this continuous? So you're just gonna, you're gonna keep going, aren't you? Uh -huh. Ha ha! And we also have a spray with flexing snowman. <laughs> Look at the little muscle! Oh, this is such a cute spray. Ash is also joining the Christmas. Oh wait, is this? Oh wait, is this her home screen skin? <laughs> I am so let down. I'm even more let down. You wonder why? Because Storm Rider is just the recolor of her raging skin. Rajin skin. I don't know how to pronounce it. This one definitely is the lesser out of the two. Because here you get two different colors. But here, they're the exact same color scheme. Just, well, Bob's looking good as ever. But Ash, well, this is mainly a Bob skin. But what does the accessories look like? We got TNT. That's, look, hey, that's looking a little bit sus, yo. And then the gun is all spiky. Wait, is this what the gun looks like for Roger to, oh my god, it's this exact same. And then, of course, Bob where he's looking stylish as ever and the coach gun again Let me know how you feel about recolor legendary skin Hanzo got a skin as well Let's see if you're celebrating the festivities or if you're just a recolor with great Tengu and it is just another Recolor skin you might think this is a scary skin and other than it being a Hanzo skin It literally is a scary skin because this was released back in like 2020 2021 for the Halloween event with Dai Tengu it, it, it literally has Tengu the name this time Time. It's purple. Is the bow any different? I don't even think the bow is all that different. Wait, May May's getting a skin? You better not have a recolor skin. Oh, oh, it's only an epic, so that's kind of a good sign. Cartographer. Co it's not my favorite May skin, but you know me. I'm gonna stand May anytime she gets a new skin. And th <laughs> this kind of looks like a World of Warcraft. Skin. Actually, a Skylander skin. That's what this reminds me of. She looks cute. And Snow oh, that's what the compass is from. Snowball has the compass on her head. And so. I'm guessing this is supposed to be the season eight battle pass theme equivalent of like a shop skin for May. And then this is what the gun is looking like. All right, so May doesn't really get a lot of green skins because blue is her main color. I mean, Honeydew is probably the only one that I'm thinking of, but it's it's an all right skin. If you like May, like me, you like the skin. If you don't, you probably don't care for the skin. And we also have a sprint. Oh, it's, it's like a Legend of Zelda map. That is so cute. And then look at Snowball. He's all happy as well. So Farrah's getting a skin. I'm going to take a guess that this is just another recolor legendary skin. Oh, it, 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 what? Nutcracker. So it is a recolor skin. It's Nutcracker. But how? Where's the cracking of nuts? Is the cracking of nuts in the room with us? So Nutcracker is just a red and green version of Enchanted Armor. And I think Enchanted Armor... What's with the Halloween skins getting a, a Christmas rendition? These better not cost 1,900 coins. <laughs> Reaper's getting a skin. This one's called Hard Light. And well, hello? Oh, that's a gun skin. Wait, this is just a <laughs> this is just another Echo Design gun skin. I thought I thought this was a normal skin for Reaper, but now so let's see what these sound like. They sound like Nerf guns. <laughs> what does the ultimate sound like though? Die, die, die. It just sounds like I'm getting hit with a pool noodle in my ear. On to Sojourn, who's getting a skin called a formal wear. Oh, oh, hey, yo, finally, a good skin for Sojourn, where she's looking very dapper. She has the Skrillex hair, though, but still, nonetheless, she's looking oh so 
fancy. What does the gun look like? Oh, what the black and white color scheme to match her suit with the gold details is where that's looking good. But she also has an emote that you know we got to equip when she wobble dee wobble dee wa wobble wobble stack stacking my paper. My wallet look like the Bible. We also have a spray where it wants to get she kind of looks like Gwen Stacy in this spray a little bit. Symmetra is also getting a skin called Sin the we're gonna call it Sin Dior because I feel like this is a designer skin and this is just once again a recolor of a BlizzCon skin. This I'm a little less upset about because this is a recolor of the 2019 virtual ticket skin where you got the Symmetra and Genji skin and just this is inspired from World of Warcraft and this is inspired from I'm guessing World of Warcraft as well. Let's look at all. I'm, yeah, I, I wait. No, maybe this is Diablo because of the writing. I, I never play any other Blizzard games other than Overwatch, but there's the gun. And then these are the sentries. Tracers joining the winter. Fo wait, formal wear uh, again? Hello? Are we? Are we all be dapper this season? Oh my God! Hey, this season really is giving. You know what she looks like? She looks like Zoe from the Overwatch League because they both have style and both have a similar hairstyle. Oh, the gun looks so good. It kind of looks like the compass on, on May's gun, but this this literally is Zoe. I'm not lying. What does the victory pose look like? Oh, she gave a little shrug with the gun. Overwatch League? What? Oh, it got shut down. Sorry. Oh my god. And then we got a spray where she's looking all formal. Ostentatious Oxton. This is not a real word. Y'all just made that up. Please tell me Widowmaker also got a formal skin. I doubt Wild Tracker is a formal skin. That is the opposite of a formal skin, but I'm loving it. I want her to be my predator and I want to be her prey. I want her to kill me. What does the gun look like? Oh, the purple. Oh, that color gradient whenever it glistens in the sun. That's looking good. See, this is what I want from the shop. No recolorations, some new stuff. We made it to support. And Anna is joining the fun with Black Braid. I'm guessing this is a recolor skin. It literally is a recolor. What are with all the Halloween skins getting? They're not even Christmas skins. So Black Braid, which is a purple Anna pirate skin. And then here we got Corsair, a pirate Anna skin that I feel like has a way better color palette. But I love the red parrot. What does the gun look like? Okay, just a, a purple sniper ship gun. Like, like, like I said before, the skins by themselves look fantastic. I just feel like these are a cop-out because well we've already seen these skins before they used to do this back in 2016 with the summer games event where they gave us the same two skins just with different color palettes we surprisingly skip Iliari and go all the way to Kariko which is always a blizzard's favorite with her festive skin it's just timekeeper with a different color scheme she looks good I like the color festivities that we got going on but come on we got a blue and white timekeeper Kariko skin and a festive skin the only difference between the color palette I'm guessing is the snowflake on her head and maybe the paper. Okay, the paper is at least a little bit different. And okay, so we got a little green emerald going on. And oh, okay, so it looks like an ornament. So it's not totally the same, I guess. More is getting a skin and only a skin, which means this is probably just a recolor. And it is kind of, is that? No, it's not. It's magma. This is literally just her classic skin, but with a, a red skin. So we have magma and then we have, okay. It, the, the, the clothes are a little bit different, but it, it's still kind of the same. Let's be real. Oh my god. Hey, yo, Mercy got two skits. Tell me, please tell me that it's the home screen. Is it Jingle Bell? Finally, we got the home screen skin for Mercy. Why did Ash get one? I'm, hey, I'm appreciative of this one because, my gosh, she looks so cute and adorable, bro. She got the sleeveless sweater with the sexy gloves. What does the, the, the staff look like? Oh, she's got the north star that does like wait there's a snowman in it there's a snowman in the staff what does the pistol look like oh it's got fruit on the red nose right near his nose oh my god and that's not all we also have a weapon skin called hard light which is just Echo skin for, for Mercy. Of course, they want to sell these new gun skins, so they give it to one of the most popular heroes of all time. All right, does the flight have any sound? Nope. What about when I boost you? Feeling more powerful? Uh, get out of my way. Nothing. Maybe when I heal them? I'll make sure that doesn't stop. No. Nope. What about when I shoot my little pistol? This sounds like an Echo Mercy skin gun. This gun sounds more baby than her normal pistol. Like, I don't know how to describe it. It just sounds so, like, puny. <laughs> we also got a highlight intro. Home Hold on a second. We got to equip this with homemade cookies. Ah. <laughs> Mercy made 
games are spoiled, dude. Literally, if you don't get a single item in 2024, I don't care. I don't want to hear it because you're getting so much. And the reindeer headband. Wait, she has a head. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that headband, man. And that was the final item. Well, let's go back to Mercy. Let me know what your favorite skin out of all these shop skins are, whether it's a recolor or a brand new one like Mercy. And until next holiday season, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. More of our two videos to come and bye.